What is H3C in organic chemistry? If you're studying organic chemistry and keep seeing the notation H3C or CH3, you might be wondering what it means and why it's written in two different ways. Let's break it down. In organic chemistry, H3C and CH3 both represent the same thing, a methyl group. A methyl group is a part of a molecule that consists of one carbon atom bonded to three hydrogen atoms. The carbon atom in this group also has a fourth bond that can attach to other parts of the molecule. The difference in notation comes down to how the molecule is being represented. When you see CH3, it's a more common way to write the methyl group, emphasizing the carbon atom at the center. This notation is clear and straightforward, showing that the carbon is bonded to three hydrogen atoms. On the other hand, H3C is another way to write the same methyl group, but it can be used in specific contexts to clarify the structure. For example, when drawing a structural formula, using H3C can help show the correct bonding sequence, especially when the methyl group is attached to a larger molecule or a benzene ring. This notation ensures that the carbon atom's bonds are clearly depicted. To illustrate, consider the compound dimethyl ether, which has the structural formula H3COCH3. Here, H3C and CH3 both represent methyl groups attached to an oxygen atom. The use of H3C in this context helps to show the correct orientation of the methyl groups in the molecule. In summary, H3C and CH3 are interchangeable notations for a methyl group in organic chemistry. The choice between them often depends on the context and how the molecule is being represented. Both notations help chemists accurately describe and visualize the structure of organic compounds.